hope you have a better understanding of the reading components of balanced literacy. The following video clips are from members of the curriculum writing team sharing their ideas of how you can prepare for next year. We've been learning a lot about balanced literacy and there are several different components to it. I think that we've been using some of these components and in order for us to delve in a little bit deeper, we want to make sure that we have a full understanding of what they are. We've been given our continuum book, and a lot of times I like to turn to the grade level that I am teaching. But if you would actually take a moment and look through the introduction, it gives you a lot of information about each one of those components. So if you want to focus on one, but you don't know where to begin, this is a great place. So we have this beautiful opportunity this year to start learning the components of balanced literacy. Many of you are already experts, and that's awesome. Take a component that you're comfortable learning about, such as interactive read aloud or shared reading or guided reading. Try that in your classroom for a few weeks. Ask for some feedback, pair up with a cool peer that you trust, and ask to get some feedback. Please use your PLC time as well, any reading intervention teachers or literacy coaches that you have in your building to help build your confidence level with those components. Next year we're jumping in and this year we want to gear ourselves with enough information and preparation as possible so just jump in, get your feet wet, and enjoy the ride. Hi, I like to keep this at my teacher table when prompting my students to be consistent with what our RI teachers are teaching. You can see elephants at the zoo. The baby elephant can walk on the day it is born. I noticed that Joseph did a great job on his assessment. Don't be afraid to stop a BAS and give a more challenging text. This helps guide your instruction with your students. We all know that Storytown is going away and being obsolete next year, but the books for all learners can be kept. And I'm keeping mine in a bag all together by strategy and then labeling the bag with the guided reading level.